Hi, I hope all of you are well. It is the time for us to disconnect next year's planner with the current year's planner. Those who have have watched my video and understood the concept behind it, they will be happy with it because they only have to do the admin once and this will uh, copy through your what you have done in the current year's planner. Those who doesn't get it will be pretty annoyed because they can't type into this. Yep. <laughs> so this is what, um, how it works, the master tab, this um, gives data to the next year's master tab and then the data is filtered through that way. But in the next two weeks, I'm going to be disconnecting it. So this will be, all of these will be gone. Yeah. So this is actually going to be um, standalone um standalone planner but actually is going to be within the network of 2019 so 2018 network is disconnected yeah so i'm just going to go through what i will be doing to your um planner so when you actually see see it you will know oh yeah it has been disconnected okay so first of all, the extra rows I will delete. So that's the first telltale sign. And then I will remove the drop down because you're not choosing the name from uh, last year's planner anymore, you see. So get rid of this, okay? You see, at the moment, it's still connected uh, to the last year planner. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna disconnect the um uh the the formula now so that will be selecting the entire area control c control shift v so once that is done um you can just go like this and the whole thing doesn't disappear but i will still leave the black uh cells as um a blank space because if you actually leave a, a blank space it will filter through to this one here and then it will filter the bridge and then it will become a blank space and that can be very annoying for people to, who does the bridges because they think that uh, something has been deleted so if you see a black uh, cell like this please put in a dash if I forget to um, unprotected, please tell me. Yeah. Um, so this part I will um, get rid of bin it. Yeah. So I'm gonna bin the protection, and then last, well, not lastly, but I'm going to put in the drop down for the rotor time. So if you see all of these telltale signs, then you know that uh, it has been disconnected. And then here, you see every every single person will have a formula. So if um, 365 formulas, control at will show you, control at, see, so on and on and on. This will slow you down in immensely. The more partner you do, you just multiply it by 365 and you'd be shocked, okay? So what I would do, I'm gonna do this um, to show you, Control Shift down arrow key to select the whole um, area, Control C to copy, Control Shift V to paste. Yeah, I'm gonna be removing the formula. So um, it will run, a lot quicker so therefore if you actually change the rotor here okay you add a rotor time yeah it has got no impact on here because the link has been broken and that will be another video um, those who know how to do it they, they would know those who haven't done it just look for a video on how to change the rotor time 
I just go back to control at again control at and you see the form um, the uh, viewing the formulas is gone yeah so if you spot all these telltale signs that's when your um, planner has been disconnected please uh, um, be patient with me it will be done f uh, from next week for the next two weeks yeah we'll spend like maybe two weeks on it Thank you very much. Goodbye.